Um, before I go, I just wanted to discuss. Yeah, I'm back. Hey, y'all. And this time, I'm with my friends. I just need to. I was watching the Titanic today, right? <laughs> the Titanic was on AMC today, and I was sitting and I was like, you know what? This has to quite possibly be the best slash dumbest movie I've ever seen in my life. I was sitting watching it and I was like, the stuff that went on now, granted, we all know that Titanic is based upon true events. That's all. There was no Rose. There was no Jack. I mean, I'm sure there was somebody who, you know, probably liked each other on the boat. But there was no Rose. There was no Jack. Um, I want to know how much of the, the Titanic story is, or the one that we saw with Leonardo DiCaprio and what's the name, is actually true. Because if them violin players, if them wind instrument players was still on that boat, Playing them little instruments while the ship was in the middle of going down. They dead ass wrong. And if anything, they should have had priority seating on the little boats. Because they were the, they were the, they were the entertainment. So they should have got like some type of like one way pass out of there before the boat even like split in half. And speaking of boats splitting in half. What? When I was watching, I was sitting there like, this is some momentous type shit. Like I've never... Seen anything like I've seen Poseidon? Have you guys seen Poseidon? I thought Poseidon was bad. That bitch flipped over upside down completely. Okay, and it was still like up in it was still above water, it just flipped upside down. The Titanic just like split in half, tipped over, and it was sunk down. I was like, This is some shit. How did like what was your thought process like with if I was Leonardo DiCaprio and Rose? Or Jack and Rose. Like, what is the thought process as you're standing over a balcony, vertical, not horizontal anymore, vertical, and you are facing negative something degree water, and you're getting ready to plummet into it, aka your death, and you just like going down slowly and slowly. I was like, what the fuck was they thinking? Like, what? I wonder how many green screens and Things that they have to pull off to get to. Because I love the Titanic. I really love Celine Dion. I, I think I just like that song. But I could say. I never watched like the first. Maybe like two, three hours of Titanic. Maybe even four. I only watched when the shit started hitting the fan. And you know stuff started going down. And people started screaming. And what's funny was. I was looking at like. when they, um, Before it split. And it was just like tipped. The people that I was like sliding down a little thing, I was like, that looks like fun. They're like sliding into the water. Granted, the water is like negative something degrees and they're essentially going to die. But like if it was like room temperature water, you just like slide down into it. That would be fun. I would think. But um, and that's neither here nor there. I just want to discuss the movie. Because I just want to know how you guys felt. I need to know. <clears throat> Excuse me. About the Titanic. Um, that's it. I really didn't want much. I seriously didn't. And I love you guys for watching. Peace. I got a meeting in the ladies room. I don't need this.